Hi, I'm Enguerrand Loss. I'm the founder of Case Coach. I'm a former interviewer with McKinsey. In this video, Rose will tell you how to answer the question, walk me through your resume. A simple but challenging question that you are very likely to face in interviews at BCG, Bain, and many other top employers. Your answer to this question will shape the rest of your interview, so you need to get it right. Let's get started. Many fit interviews start with a tell me about yourself type of question. Candidates often prepare for this by rehearsing a long and exhaustive overview of their background in chronological order. And they launch into this for several minutes at the start of the interview. This is the wrong approach. A monologue like this will lead your interviewer to disengage and will break rapport. It won't leave any room for your interviewer to steer the conversation to what they want to talk about and to discuss your achievements at the level of depth that they need in order to assess your capabilities. Instead, you want to hover at a high level of abstraction without going into many details. In practice, this will mean your introduction is quite short, but it will cover a lot of ground. After that, your interviewer will follow up with further questions and you'll be able to engage in a conversation that dives into the content in more detail. You may want to hint at things you'd like to talk about in your introduction, but you should only allude to them. Often your interviewer will pick up on these points and you'll talk about them in more depth once you get into conversation. But while you can influence the direction of the conversation, your interviewer can choose to talk about anything in your background. You should therefore be prepared to speak about anything on your resume, since you can never fully predict what might come up. In practical terms, your introduction should last 30 seconds to around a minute, and you may want to make it even shorter than that. There are three basic steps to follow when you articulate your introduction. First, give the big picture. Here you'll give your current position, a brief summary of your journey so far, and maybe a snippet of information from outside work as well. Second, introduce your narrative. Try and articulate what has driven your academic, extracurricular and professional journey so far in more conceptual terms. This is important to think about properly, since it will most likely come up again when it comes to the discussion of your interest in consulting. Last, offer to go into more detail. Sometimes though, you won't need to do this since your interviewer will jump in and immediately ask about a particular experience. Either way, the outcome is the same. You'll end up going into detail on particular experiences from here. Let's watch how this plays out in our model interview. So look, we're going to cover a case, but before we get onto that, I wanted to just talk a bit about your background and your career aspirations as well. Could we start with you just telling me a bit more about yourself and giving me a quick overview of your background? Yeah, sounds good. Um, do, do you want one, Matthew? Yeah, absolutely, yeah. Um, so basically, I'm a, I'm a computer engineer by training, uh, but at the moment, I'm a first year MBA student at Columbia Business School. Um, I have six years work experience, uh, first two years uh, as an entrepreneur in technology, uh, and the last four years prior to business school uh, in venture capital. All of this in Paris. Right. Um, so really, if you, if you see the thread, it's, I'm someone with a strong interest in technology, that's why I studied computer engineering, uh, but also a passion for business. And that's what led me to uh, sell my own companies and then uh, right. be at business school and, and in venture capital. As you can see, this can all be done very quickly. And from here, the real discussion begins, during which you'll flag achievements and examples of your performance at various points in the conversation. Thank you for watching till the end. If you found the video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you want to learn more about the FIT interview and how to prepare for it, join our interview prep course on Case Coach. The course includes eight live FIT interviews and our techniques to answer critical FIT interview questions. Now, if you'd like to get more free videos and prep material, just follow the link below to sign up to our mailing list. See you soon on casecoach.com.